Hello you too, this is Phoenix MDW, and I am pleased to be back with you for another Let's Play. This one is a favorite, Godfather 2. I really enjoyed the first Godfather, and I, from what I have played of the second, I've only made it to Florida, so I've not going to beat the game by any means, but um, I really like it. I enjoy it a great deal. Uh, there was a little bit of an introduction, not much, uh, but rather than watch that and then have you guys sit there and watch me fiddle with all the, you know, the appearance options, I just went ahead and passed that and went to the appearance options. Um, just in case anyone is, likes my look, I definitely have a style for my mafia, I'm being the future Don. Um, this is kind of the choice that I went with, although I think I may switch the vest around a little bit. Um, go to coats, advanced, because I don't really, th I think it's too much red, so let's, let's try it this way. I'm going to back this up a little bit. And then bump this one up to red. Because I want there to be a little, little more contrast there. I don't want there to be a ton of red in the... Yeah, that's a little better. Okay, great. So, as you can see, my mob colors are black and red. Um, starting from the top, he's got a black and red fedora and tuxedo jacket and pants with a Y collar shirt and vest. Um, and uh, that's pretty much it. He's got, and he's also got the leather gloves, which I love. So let's go ahead and get started. Jump right in. Except. Bring it here, let me see it. My age had better be correct. I am always accurate about my age. May you live to 100, Mr. Roth. Congratulations. Cheers. Congratulations. Salute. Well, the doctors might disagree, but what do they know? <laughs> These are wonderful things we've achieved in Cuba. This government knows how to help business to encourage it. The hotels here are bigger and swankier than any of the rug joints we put up in Vegas. Not all hotels. <laughs> Michael Corleone's accepted, of course. But the point I'm making is this, that now we have what we have always needed, real partnership with a government. Salute. Salute. Cheers. Salute. And at the time of my retirement, I turn over all my interests in the Cuba operation to you, my partners. To the Corleone family and all of Trapani, the Hotel Capri. Grazie. The Nationale will go to Rico Granados and the Sevilla Biltmore to Samuel Mangano, here with us all the way from Sicily. The rest of you will also share in handling my non-casino operations. Gentlemen, rebels and petty criminals are Cuba's past. We are its future. Lachaim. Gendan, salute. Salute. Looks like they made a dent in the cake. That's me, looking pretty sexy if I must say so myself. Fredo, you're just like your brother. You're smart. I'm guessing this is some sort of New Year's celebration. Alright, so let's go ahead and have a, have a talk with Michael. What's on your mind, Dominic? How you enjoying Cuba? It's great, Michael. I like the little things here, you know? Nice change of pace from New York. That's good. When this deal is done, we're gonna do great things in this country. Tomorrow's a new year, my friend. The start of a new future for the Corleone family. Salud. To the future. By the way, where did Aldo go? He went downstairs for the New Year's celebration. You should talk to him. Make sure everything is set for tomorrow's meeting. Alright, so, um, if you take a look around, you can see that we're a 
this up. I want that car right there. Um, graphics in the game are, are pretty nice. I love the fireworks. So let's go talk to Aldo. Your brother is making the right decision, Fredo. I know. Mikey's got a good head on his shoulders. Once the deal's done, you should that's open Michael Corleone's brother. Do it as a favor for me. Cuba first, then America. I cannot be spread too thin. Corleone ponied up two million in cash. See, Pazzo, how can I compete with that? Hmm, looks like some of our colleagues slash competitors are not able to compete with the Corleones. Kind of bounce down here and see what's going on. How do they say it? Feliz Nuevo Año or something? Close. It's Feliz Año Nuevo. Okay, and we're going right along. I believe we're supposed to go down here and talk to our boss. I don't care. Let's just get on the next flight back to Florida. Hmm, I like your outfit. It's kind of a sassy looking outfit there, dude. Boss, boss, where are you, boss? Oh, you know what? I think he's on the other side of the curtains. So check that out. Aha! There you go. Hey, boss. Boss, you all right? Michael wanted me to make sure that everything's set for tomorrow's meeting. Don't worry about it, Dominic. It's taken care of. I'm just anxious to get back to New York. I don't like it here. I don't trust what the president says, you know, about the rebels. I just want to get out of here. Uh, the rebels are nothing. Uh, we'll see. I don't want to say that. Let's say, uh, don't worry, Aldo. Come on, Aldo. You really think the rebels are going to be a problem? Yeah, I do. You know what I saw on my way over here? I saw a rebel being arrested. And instead of being taken alive, he exploded a grenade hidden in his jacket. They can win. That's some serious shit. One man, Look, come boss. On. One man with one grenade. It's hardly going to take down an army. I know. It's just I got a bad feeling being here. Look, I'll be better after tomorrow. Let's get this New Year stuff over with, finish the deal, and go back to New York. Michael, Fredo, the countdown's about to start. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and pause this real quick because my timer is just about to run out. I hope you've enjoyed our first Let's Play of The Godfather 2. If you liked it, please go ahead and leave a like. It helps tremendously. Um, and by all means, if you want to, you know, subscribe to the channel, please do. I will see you for the next installment. Peace out.